My name is Dr. Maury Gertz, and I'm the chair of the Department of Medicine at Mayo Clinic Rochester. I'd like to discuss optimal management of patients with Waldenstrom's macroglobulinemia. Waldenstrom's macroglobulinemia is a unique form of a hematologic malignancy. Mayo Clinic has had an interest in this disorder now for over 50 years. Waldenstrom's macroglobulinemia is a bone marrow disorder where the bone marrow becomes involved with abnormal cells that are often referred to as lymphoplasmacytic lymphoma that can cause reduction in the blood counts, enlargement of the liver, spleen, and lymph nodes. Unique to Waldenstrom's macroglobulinemia is the production of an abnormal protein, the so-called IgM protein. This protein adds a unique dimension to the care of patients with Waldenstrom's macroglobulinemia because this abnormal protein can cause changes in the viscosity of the blood, can damage the nerves, can gel as a cryoglobulin, or can destroy red blood cells in the form of hemolytic anemia. Rarely, the IgM protein can deposit in the tissues as amyloid deposits. This unusual lymphoplasmacytic lymphoma in an average medical practice is seen once every 10 years. At Mayo Clinic, we currently see approximately one patient every week for consultation with the disease, and it gives us an enormous depth of experience and management. Waldenstrom's is both a complex and rare disorder, and focusing on a team that is integrated, cooperates closely, and focused on the patient is important for an optimal outcome. Although when you come for a consultation, you may see a single physician, it's important to recognize the level of team commitment behind the scenes. Although the physician that gives you your consultation and talks to you about all the treatment options is the team leader, underpinning that are dedicated physicians in hematopathology who are experienced in interpreting bone marrows from patients with Waldenstrom's macroglobulinemia. Imaging experts in the Department of Radiology who are skilled at interpreting the findings that are seen, for example, on computerized tomography, CT of the abdomen, and the results that would be anticipated in Waldenstrom's macroglobulinemia. Just as important, given the multisystemic involvement that's associated with Waldenstrom's macroglobulinemia, are teams of dedicated neurologists for those patients who have problems with numbness in their feet, kidney specialists because of the unique aspects of involvement of the kidney, experts in blood banking and plasma exchange, since plasma exchange can play such an important role in the management of Waldenstrom's macroglobulinemia. Rare patients can have lung involvement with Waldenstrom's. And in each of these fields, Mayo has a specialist who has a depth of experience, usually extending over many years. Moreover, the integrated nature of Mayo Clinic allows the physicians direct communication at any time via the integrated electronic medical record or by simply picking up the telephone call and discussing a patient-specific problem. Since we share an electronic record, every physician seen by a patient with Waldenstrom's macroglobulinemia, their records are instantaneously shared across our entire institution by the entire spectrum of specialists charged with providing care for the patients. We believe, particularly for newly diagnosed patients or patients who have uncertainty regarding their next steps, seeking consultation by an integrated physician team that has a knowledge basis, depth, and expertise to provide optimal care is essential. Not only do we operate with integration in Rochester, we also share across our sites in Arizona and in Florida. Wallenstrom's research is actively ongoing both in Rochester laboratories as well as in Arizona laboratories as we explore gr the growth potential and the genetics of Wallenstrom's macroglobulinemia. Likewise, because Rochester has such a large Wallenstrom's practice, 
we have access to medications and new treatments that aren't available locally. These regimens are developed by specialists in clinical trials of Waldenstrom's, both in Rochester and in Arizona, and are available at all three of our sites.